end of the road, auto fools. Transform! So, it's you, Scourge. The clanking racket of your engines is going to burst my transducers. I'm going to shut them up, permanently. It's a fight. Hello Autobots and Decepticons, my name is Soulmonger and I'd like to welcome you guys back to the Transformers. And it's a fight between Rodimus Prime and the leader of the sweeps, Scourge. And of course, Scourge made by Unicron as well as Cyclonus and Galvatron, but he has his own Huntsman, the Deadly Sweeps. And I'm not talking about like a broom that comes into your house and sweeps you clean. No, 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 no. These are evil Decepticons that are very strong, as well as Scourge, although he does get bossed around from time to time from Galvatron either way. So let's find Scourge. Where could he be hiding? He's not by the invisible wall. Come on, Scourge. What do you got, bro? Come on. Oh, he's already dead. He's already dead. No wonder I'm not even paying attention. Who has killed him already? Optimus? Springer? You guys are good. Such warriors. I appreciate it. And one thing that I want to say about Scourge, it is not really a fact about him, but I always think about the book Redwall whenever I hear Scourge. Oh, here he is. Here he is. And now it's time for him to die. Come on, Scourge. Let's go. Oh, just coming in from behind. But I always think of the book. Ooh, that was a nice little jump kick. Nice little jump kick. But I always do think of the book Redwall because the villain in that book was named Scourge as well. And it's a pretty evil name. But Scourge... Evil may be your name, but fighting is Rodimus' game. So let's go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Come on. Let's go with the big gun. No big deal. I didn't say I was going to fight fair, and I might toss you around a little bit. We're going to need a cleanup around here. Bring out the brooms, because I'm about to sweep Scourge away and out of this mine. Because this mine is mine, and so is the Zelkarts. Let's go. You're spending more time on your back here, Scourge. I am in the zone, I am fighting quite well as Rodimus, and I have a blaster that just destroys. Come here, Scourge, come here. Oh, you want to get picked up? You want to get picked up? Oh, now he's fighting a little bit rough. But rough is not good enough, because you gotta fight better than rough. You gotta bring him the power. Booyah, Rodimus. No guns, no victory for Scourge. Autobots win. You got me. Just spare my life. Transform. Well, that's all he can handle, I guess. This big thing must be the crystal. Right. It looks like we beat the Decepticons here. Let's take it and get out of here. Well, well, well. You have made it here. Zyklonus is indeed useless. Who are you? Six shot at your service. There is not just one soul in the body. Witness, Autobot. My magic. This must be some kind of illusion. You shall soon see that this is no illusion. On guard. Transform. So, a trickster? Well, let's do it, Decepticon. It's fight time. He fights. He destroys, he kills, he has no mercy, he is Six Shot. And Six Shot, you're going down this time, bro, but Six Shot is an extremely feared Decepticon. He is the first Transformer to be able to transform into six different things, hence his name, Six Shot. So we're going to find the right one and destroy him here because we... Do not want to give him any mercy whatsoever. He lives to taste blood. He is basically 
an assassin, and that's all he cares about is killing his victim. He believes that life is only given for him to destroy it. He is quite the feared Decepticon, but when you're this strong and this good looking as Rodimus Prime, and of course, the user too, right? I mean, he's, he's pretty good looking. That's what, that's just what I've heard. Just rumor on the street. Anyways, we're here to destroy Six Shot. Here he is. Let's go. Bot Econ. Good versus evil. Six Shot. I got respect because you are a good fighter. But you're going to have to respect the blaster. Booyah. Rodimus coming in hot. Decepticons draped all over me. It doesn't matter. No big deal. Come on, Six Shot. Let's see some of those transformations. They won't get you out of this. I am on fire, and I'm going to, to send you to oblivion. The great junkyard down under. And I know you would prefer to go to the one in the sky, but your type doesn't go there. Booyah, Rodimus Prime. Booyah. Optimus taking the glory. Booyah, Optimus. I shall have my revenge. Retreat. I was hit pretty hard myself, but we protected the crystal. Okay, let's get it back at once and analyze it. Transform! I am a comrade of the Autobots. May I fight with you? A true-born warrior with a strong will for justice, Ultra Magnus. With justice and courage, his hidden power protects the world of the future. He is a strong and most excellent Transformer. Ultra Magnus, it's good to hear your voice again. Your voice alone gives us all courage. You're exaggerating, Commander Rodimus but it's a privilege to fight again alongside one such as yourself. Let's go punish the enemy! Nice! We unlocked the strong and most excellent Transformer, Ultra Magnus. I felt like I was in a Bill and Ted movie there with that line. Oh yeah, and we have completed the level, so that levels up our characters real nice. I'm excited to try out Ultra Magnus next time, because he is a brave soldier. And we got quite a bit of Energon cubes. I would have liked to have gotten more, but that will have to do, and we should be able to pull off some nice upgrades on our vehicles and our robot forms as well. So, let's see if there is an epic cutscene coming up. I'm hoping so. What are the results of the analysis, Wheeljack? The crystal really is an amazing stone. It's been a lot of fun examining it. But it's just a new kind of giant crystal. But that's all it seems to be. I see. Even though we fought so hard to get it. It's too bad, but it sure was something to get a look at that great big crystal. I suppose we have to return it? Of course. It's very valuable. I will return it to the mine's laboratory as soon as possible. I'll go with you, Commander. Uh, uh, very well then. Oh, yeah. Arcee, I've got something for you. Huh? Me? This is a jewel? Where? When we were getting the crystal, this got mixed in with the dirt. I was thinking of getting rid of it, but I thought you might like it. Rodimus? I'm tired of this reputation I have about not being good with the ladies. After this, maybe she'll think differently of me. Rodimus! How could you? Huh? What... what do you mean? Even if it was just an accident, this jewel can't be carried out of the mine like any old pebble. Taking it out of the mine without permission is the same as stealing. 
It must be returned with the crystal. But, well, if, if you put it that way... <laughs> you were careless, Rodimus. R.C.'s right. Your punishment shall be to take my place and go return the stones with R.C. Uh, yes, sir. Sheesh. It's easier to fight Decepticons than get along with a woman. The Autobots had investigated all the minerals that they thought might be the Zell Quartz, but none of them were what they were looking for. Ooh, we've been looking everywhere for that quartz, but it's just been a big waste of time, huh, Commander? Don't say that, Jazz. It hasn't been a waste. Let there be no doubt about it. If we hadn't gone, the Decepticons would have destroyed all those facilities. But we still haven't found the Zell Quartz, have we? What should we do now? Indeed, that's a good question. Commander, I know where the Zell Quartz is. What? Are you sure? Yeah, the two of us had a good search through all the old archives. We found that when this planet was being pioneered, a strange, incredibly powerful mineral was found. That rock took its name from the planet it was found on. Zell Rock! Zell Rock? No doubt about it. That's the Zell Quartz. So, where is it right now? There's a facility where they convert the energy cultivated on this planet into a laser beam for transmission back to the home planet. It's called the Enormous Laser Transmission Array, or ELTA for short. The rock is being used in the central core. Right. Let's get there right away. Everyone, prepare for departure. Yes, yes sir. sir. Oh, Rodimus steps up to the plate, swings and strikes out with the ladies. What is going on there? RC just denying him. Nobody would have cared if she would have took the crystal and he was trying to be nice and score a date. Come on. But then Optimus just laughs it off. I, I, what is going on even there? That is hilarious. Anyways, I'll see you guys all next time. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe for more. Also, click the screen for more awesome videos over at Bro Bras. Have a great day.